Let's move to the Maggid of Dov now. Why is it important to prepare for Yamim Nuraim in Elul? And he brings down a beautiful story. A thief once noticed that a certain shop was making a lot of business, doing a lot of money. He was watching from the street, you know, when they, when they want to like, do a hit on a store, say so they watch the store. And you see certain stores are very successful. Well, there was one store that was extremely successful. Day in and day out, he was keeping an eye on this store. And he says they must have a huge cash turnover. And every day, at a certain time, like an hour before closing, a young man exits the store, obviously with a, lot, with a pile full of cash, and makes his way towards the local bank, where he obviously deposits a significant amount of money. And he's thinking and he's thinking, how do I pull this heist off? Now, I can't do this. I can't go grabbing the guy's bag in the middle of there, because a lot of people on the street, they'll catch me. So, he comes up with an amazing idea. He notices that there's an upscale men's suit store, not far. He walks in and he speaks to the proprietor of the store and he says, my boss is a very wealthy man. He wants to buy the best suit you guys have. So he says, sir, come on in. Let me show you the materials that we have. And he starts showing him the materials. This is the so-called thief. And as he's looking at the materials, he goes, but I have to measure your boss. I only make custom-made clothing. Tell him to come in. He says, wow, the thief tells him, you got a point there. He says, what should we do? He goes, you know, let's go outside and maybe I could find someone that has the same body type as my boss. Who's coming? Our friend with the money. So he says, you see that guy over there carrying the briefcase? He's exactly the same size. Let's go approach him. So the owner, he thinks he has a good sale. He goes over to this man with the, with the briefcase with full of money. And he says, sir, 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 can I just ask you for a favor? As you can see, I sell top of the line clothing. Would you model one for us? And the guy was like, you know, wow, he's getting covered. Sure, I'll come in. So he comes in and he puts the suit on. And while he's trying it on, the thief grabs the bag and he runs out. Suddenly the man with the, the, the owner of the, of the money he says, hey, come back here. You take... Go get him, he's a thief. No. So he tries to leave the store, but the owner says, where are you going? He says, my suit. And Malgad of Dovno says, this is what's going on. All year long, Hashem is waiting for us to deliver the package. But unfortunately, the Eight Sahara comes and he takes it from us. He misdirects us. He says, let's have pleasures. Let's have distractions. And we don't deliver the merchandise to Hashem. And that's what happens. We have to be careful. Elul is giving us that rare opportunity to wake up and make sure that we're not distracted by the Eight Sahara. Make sure that he doesn't deceive us so that we, we allow him to take the bag full of gold, our Torah mitzvahs. Make sure that we are able to deliver that merchandise where it needs to go and not be misled by him.